Thermopylae. They say you can't walk this battlefield without getting blood on your toes. If you close your eyes, you can hear them. Their final war cries before every last one of those brave Spartans perished. Their voices were silenced that day, but their story will be sung for an eternity. You didn't bring me here to talk about dead Spartans. What's on your mind, Herodotus? The Battle of Thermopylae still echoes in our hearts, but to stand here is to feel it in your bones. There's nothing here but ghosts. My concerns are with the living. Hold out your spear. My spear? What for? I need to know something. Herodotus! I'm fine. I'm fine. The stories are true. That is the spear of Leonidas. The hero's blade. Where were Sparta's allies? The Spartans weren't alone in facing Xerxes and his hordes. Many from across the Greek world were armed and ready to fight alongside Leonidas and his 300. But when the mighty king looked into their eyes and saw fear, he sent them home. That sounds like madness, not bravery. It was foretold by the Pythia that Sparta would lose either its freedom or its king to the Persians. Leonidas made his choice. What happened to Leonidas after the battle? Xerxes was famous for honoring warriors who fought valiantly against the Persians. But Leonidas infuriated him so much, he cut off his head and impaled it on a pike. A bloody battle ensued, and his remains were reclaimed by the Spartans and buried here. Now, however, he rests where he belongs. In Sparta. What happened to the traitor, Ephialtes? King Xerxes paid him well. 
But treachery breeds treachery. A contract was put on his head, and he died as he lived. A coward. You knew this would happen. I didn't know, but I did suspect. There is a place I'd convinced myself was a dream. Until now. A peculiar structure on the island of Andros. Mysterious shapes carved in stone. Like nothing I've ever seen. You want to sail to Andros so you can show me shapes? In my travels, I heard whispers of an ancient civilization. A people who came before. Your spear and that place are connected. You mentioned the people that came before. Who were they? They were not gods, but they lived far longer than any mortal and were far more intelligent. I've seen carvings in caves, strange symbols that suggest it was this ancient civilization that created humankind and provided them with fire. But Zeus blamed Prometheus. Yes. Well, perhaps his eagle has been feasting on the wrong liver. The spear awakened to you, Herodotus. I trust you. You understand. I will do everything in my power to help you find your mother. I promise. But first, we must sail to the island of Andros. I'll meet you at my ship. Welcome aboard the Adrestia, Irodotos. Will you be traveling with us? Only for a short trip. I have business to attend to in Athens. Irodotos is helping me find my mother. Seeking help from the gods has put Irodotos on your path, just like they put you on mine. They work in ways beyond our comprehension. And all we can do is follow their lead. You could be right. Irodotos and I shall be Like in Pinor? She is. Was part of a very powerful group called the Cult of Cosmos that controls the Greek world through the Oracle. Control the Oracle? Impossible! Apollo would not allow that! Now they're looking for my mother. I need to find her before they do. And I believe they will hurt others who oppose their views along the way. By Hermes! The Oracle lost to corruption, and now this cult? Do we know who leads them? I don't know for sure. But I think it might be my brother. Your brother? Why, Zeus, your life is complicated. Tell me. But don't you worry. This cult of Cosmos now has three new enemies. And one of them fights like Athena and shit thunder like Zeus. We'll bring the wrath of the gods down upon them. Is he always this positive? Always. That's why I like him. Poseidon, carry us to Athens! First, we need to go to Andros. To Andros, then! We're going to have to do some upgrades to my ship if we're sailing into war. What do you mean? Well, she's old, and perhaps not in the best condition. You couldn't have said this before we set sail? Where in Poseidon's name are we going to get the supplies? My father taught me that the sea takes. And we must do the same. Fortunately, there are plenty of pirate ships in these waters that we can board and take from. What are we waiting for? Let's hunt some pirates. The gods are... Enemies are close. Get ready. Archers! Danger here! 
Leonidas was her father. Incredible. And it gives you visions. Perhaps it's trying to guide you. Show you a path. There's more. It helps me in battle. What do you mean? I can't really describe it. It's like I know that my opponent's next move will be just before it happens. Fascinating. This is just extraordinary. <laughs> Here it is. before. How do I get inside? I wonder if... Hesitation only hastens. The grave, I know, Mater. Your form is improving. Your resolve is strong. But you're not taking action. I was going to. I know. But it's the moments in between that decide everything. Your turn. Leonidas' spear. You're old enough now. My father's spear holds a certain burden, but you're ready. something. Huh? The spear. It has magic. Carries with it a long line of power. A bloodline of incredible heroes. The same blood within you and me and our family. All of us? Think of Leonidas. He had great courage. And he made a great sacrifice. 
you share in his blood and the strength he possessed. We are able to feel certain things happening around us. That is our family's gift. But not everyone understands that. Some recognize the power we bear and want it only for themselves. They will try to take it from us. I won't let them. I know. You're a warrior. If we keep moving forward, always moving forward, we're untouchable. Storm's coming in. Then maybe we should move forward now. <laughs> Mother, I haven't forgotten you. How does a place like this exist? How could I even explain this to someone like Marcos? Something's glowing over there. This imprint is shaped like the sword Demos had at the cultist's meeting. Was it forged in this place? Spear is stronger now. The cult won't stand a chance.
Well, Herodotus will be happy. It's clear someone was here far before we were. Did Leonidas know this place existed? You're not hard to track. Did you come alone? Are you all right? <laughs> Alexios, you're alive. Don't touch me. <laughs> come on, little brother. You have to tell me everything. What's happened to you? I don't have to tell you anything. I don't know you. Well, I know you. It doesn't matter. There's more important things to argue about. You're right. Like that stunt you pulled with the artifact. It got my attention, if that's what you wanted. What? The artifact showed the truth. We're family. And we made it out of Sparta alive. <laughs> yes, it did show the truth. It confirmed what I always knew. You threw me off a fucking mountain! You think it's that simple? Come on, Alexios. Let's talk about it. Stop calling me that! I already know what happened that night. Right. Demos. Now him, I don't know. He's a demigod. Worshipped and feared by the cult and all the Greek world. Sounds like a fantasy to me. Did the cult cook that story up too? I'd watch your fucking mouth, or I'll shut it for you. You didn't when you had the chance before, and I bet you won't now. This is stupid. We need to find our mother. I'm not interested in reunion. I just want to know what you think you're doing. Same thing as your cult. Looking for Mirini, our mother. They don't need her. Your cultists think differently. She's their next target. If they ever pursued her, it would be to kill her. But if you don't know where she is, that means she abandoned you too. How sad. Even if we were abandoned, we survived. We can go back to the way things were if we can find her. The cult has no interest in sentimentality or family. Its only aim is control. If it's true they're after us, tell them they'll never find Nikolaos. He's off the map. Trust me, I've searched myself. If I could find you, the other long-lost child of Nikolaos. Then I can find him. And when I do, he'll wish he was thrown off that mountain. I don't care what you think. I'll find Mirini. Do the right thing. Come with me. What? We could find her. Together. You could help me. <laughs> oh, you think friendship is the answer? Running around like lost children looking for dear mother. You're so weak. It's responsibility, not weakness. I won't abandon the whole family just for spite. Responsibility? Get off your high horse. The cult has a plan, and it won't be interrupted by the likes of you. Taking your own mother isn't enough for them? We're not abductors. We're political. Those who don't stand with us stand against us, and they pay for that mistake. Like me. Like you. I heard you're planning a trip to Athens. When you go, tell Pericles and his elitist scum they're next. 
The cult let Mirini live. They let Nikolaos live. Why kill them now? Because you live. You brought this on her and yourself. The cult is powerful, but they're mortals. I have the blood of gods, so they think you do too. But they'll see how wrong they are. I'm going after the cult, you know. You've seen our numbers. You've seen what I can do. And you still think you stand a chance? Try me. So having guts runs in the family, does it? <laughs> you claim we have the same blood. So let's see what you can do. We still found each other, brother. I told you not to touch me. Demos! <sighs> Malaka. Herodotus won't believe this. I have to tell him what happened. Was the legend true? Was it magnificent? What happened to you? And your spear? Slow down, Irodotos. My spear's stronger now. I can feel it. You were right. There was some kind of artifact there. It showed me a vision. Of me and my mother. So... The ancient civilization is real. Cassandra, you have no idea the power you possess. All harnessed in Leonidas' spear. That's not everything. Demos followed me here. The cult's already moving, he told me himself. They're going after us. My family, Pericles... Why would he tell you? Unless it was a trap. It doesn't matter. We have to get to Athens to warn Pericles. And we need to find my mother before they do. Then, we go to the Peniques. If Pericles is anywhere, he's there. 